Your core web vitals will give you a snapshot of the page speed of your website for both desktop and mobile. So it'll show you if you have good fast URLs, which will be green. URLs that need improvement will be orange. And then URLs that are doing really bad and loading slowly will be red. You want to be looking at the URLs that are getting flagged because these are actually just a snapshot. It's not going to show you every single page on your website. The issues that are occurring on the slow pages are usually things that you can fix site-wide. For example, it's telling me that some of my URLs have an LCP longer than four seconds on mobile. And if I click on those, it'll show me which pages are actually having those issues. This is an e-commerce site and it looks like some of the category pages are loading really slowly. So then I can figure out why those pages are loading so slowly and what I can do to improve them. Once you find a slow page, you can go to Page Speed Insights, which is a tool by Google that shows you exactly what's wrong with specific pages and how to fix them. So you can just give it your slow URL and run an analysis, and then it'll tell you all of the stats for that page and how to improve them. So once it's diagnosed the performance issues, you can actually see more stats and it'll give you specific things that you can do to improve your page. For example, it's saying I could save about three seconds here if I fixed render blocking requests. And all of these recommendations link to specific guides where you can improve that issue. For example, it shows me exactly how to fix render blocking requests. It's even got a guide on what you can do for WordPress websites specifically.